Hi, welcome back. My name is Viviana. Today we're gonna to talk about the apartment that I got. How, how, how did I save up? Well, I used to be a flight attendant for four years and a half. And that salary was the pivotal point of me saving up. To be fair, the first two years I did park here <laughs> and I did enjoy my life. Uh, but later I was like, okay, what can I do that's practical? Oh, and uh, happy new year. I think, uh, I think it'll be like, this will come out second week of Jan, maybe, yes. I should have said happy new year then, but whatever, it's fine. Better late than never. <laughs> okay, so the salaries in uh, UAE, like if you work there and you uh, fly, I believe, depending on how much you fly, you can earn between 2,000 to 2,500 euros, which I know for a lot of people, like, that's, that's not a lot. I know, um, but yeah, it depends. You can actually reach up almost 3,000, but it depends how much you're flying. Um, I know for some people, like, what? That's like nothing. You guys, you have no idea about the low-cost airlines. They are mm -mm, barely make them bare minimum. Advantage is, yes, the salary may be low for some people or some places, or maybe very huge for some people some places. For Romania, it is. For Romania, it's um, it's very high. It's considered very high salary pay. What was good there, they do, you don't pay for housing allowance, you don't pay for bills, you don't pay for taxi, you don't pay for rent, you don't pay those things. You don't pay for transportation. Transportation, uh, they provide when you go to work. Like they have like schedules and buses that strictly go to the airport for the flight attendants. So I pay, like I saved up a lot of money this way. Basically every month, at least half of my salary I'll put aside at least which is a lot. And in two years and a half, I managed to save up almost all of the money that I needed for the apartment. Now, this apartment I found, I mean, I saw it when they started building it back in 2016, I think it was. It catch my eye instantly. It's a 64 square meters, yes. With the balcony 68, it has like heating in the floors. It's really nice. It's new, everything is new. No, I lived in there. I'm the first owner, so I'm very happy about that. And this is the apartment that we're going to be I'm going to be doing videos on designing and things like this because it's one of my passions. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I'm gonna insert now the clip back from 2020 when I got the keys and everything. Enjoy. Give you guys a bit of a tour okay so this is the entrance just walked in here it's gonna be like the washing machine like up to floors hidden like a closet we're gonna put the laundry things and maybe a coat closet on the other side so this is the bathroom all right it's a little messy here oh i love the tub. it's like um everything here i chose myself so the tile reminds me of the desert sands and uh, from where I used to live a long time ago. And yeah, I'm gonna get one of those. I really wanted uh, the nice rain shower, can't wait. Yeah, so everything's quite beautifully made and like has like really good system. I have like, the heating is all in the floors. And you also have this one for like drying and stuff, but I will buy a machine that's two in one. All right, so as we come along, this is going to be the, yeah, ignore the open doors. I know it's like really cold outside, but my girl did not know how to use the heating system. The AC unit is over there. This is like the living room, dining room. I'm going to put like the couch right over there. And it's gonna be like a TV. I have a whole idea, but it's gonna take some time for everything to be built, like I said. Uh, so yeah, I wanna put like some kind of a dining area here. I have two lamps. I think these windows, I can see now on the video, like these windows, they're, um, I think they're sun protection protected. So yeah, this is the balcony. It's a view. It's really foggy right now. Um, cold and foggy it's so funny because it's january and it's like the first it didn't so there was no snow during the winter 
you're a little late, my friend. What to do? So the first project is going to be right here in the kitchen. This is actually towel that's imitating wood. I've always loved that look in kitchens. Like I used to see it in like so many magazines and designer trends and things like this. I love the look. The echo is really bad. I apologize. We have, because there's no furniture and the walls are quite high. It makes an echo, but it's okay. So yeah, this is the tile that's going to be here. I'm planning on making, let me search some pictures, but uh, up here is going to be like white cabinets, okay, with imitation of wood. I'm literally trying to do the cheapest way that looks the best because I feel like everyone's always buying the most expensive stuff and it's not okay. So it should have been an empty tour, but I ordered a bed and it came. Woo, yay! And yeah, the bed came. It's one of those like you, you pull it up and you have like storage under. This is the first big item I bought. Uh, the thing was, I wanted to get like the uh, mint color, but for some reason it looks a little greenish in real life. I can see on the camera it looks blue, which that's interesting. Uh, but what I like about it, it's a bit of a neutral color, so I can play around with it. I can play around with the colors and I love that. I can put like different things and you know, so yeah, I don't have a balcony in my be bedroom, but it's gonna be like a little mini. So I'm planning to put small pots everywhere. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna have so many plants. Yeah, so it looks like this also opens very nicely. Now the building is still set. And that's what happens with new buildings, you know? They tend to take cracks. I have insurance for the building for the next 10 years, but I'm planning to move those to a bit on the side. I didn't know that they were gonna do it like this when I got the place. He, I just came in and I was like, whoa, these are a bit too close because there's gonna be like a dresser and I feel like it's really close to the dresser. And he was like, no, no, it's standard. So we had a little disagreement there. He showed me how it is. I don't like it. I, the I put the bed, I still don't like it. Uh, so I'm gonna get someone to move those. Good luck finding electricians in Romania, but I'm going to do my best. Uh, oh, the doors. I love the doors. Doors, they, like the new modern age. I kind of, my style is a bit more modern uh, slash traditional. So it looks like this and light comes from the other side. So the lights is on and all the doors are like this, even the bathroom. So if someone's in the bathroom, you know, because the light's going to be on. I so yeah, that was a little tour and... Um, this is January. So yeah, that's it. I hope you like this video. If you have any ideas, I mean, I already had a couple of ideas, but if you feel like you have some better ideas or you can comment down below. And again, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm not professional any of these things. I just wanted to really try things that make me happy. Um, so here we are. So yeah, I hope you guys have a good one. And uh, next time we'll talk about kitchen which is almost done. I feel like I'm gonna run out of ideas very soon because I still, I haven't finished the apartment. There's still a lot of things that I have to do, but with uh, a pair of, like now working in Romania, the salaries are really low. They're like 18 euros. I'll put some of the currencies, but the minimum wage is between, you know, put this somewhere here or here, um, like this in different currencies, which is, I know it's very low and everything is very expensive. So it takes me a long time to put all the money aside. If you have any other questions or like this, uh, you can you can write it down. So yeah, uh, have a good one. Bye. I can see everything. Okay, well, I can barely talk and I'm so hungry. Okay, 64 square. What is that saying? Right, meter 64. Metro Patrat. Sixty four.